Hey everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Monte Vista Act 2. This is, um, oh, I don't even know what part this is. 30, 43, 44. Uh, so, yeah, the Sims, oh, we're having a bit of a lag spike. Let's see if that'll sort itself. Um, I updated my drivers earlier, and, um, my game just freaked out. It reset to a bunch of default settings. And, um, for some reason, I now have a sound glitch. I'm working on it, so there isn't any in-game sound. As it stands, there wasn't any music anyway. I'm really sorry. Um, I know it can be annoying, but I also don't get many nights where I can record by myself. Oh, they're heading home. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't get a lot of nights when the guys aren't home. And I find that I, like, I usually end up having to record really late at night. It's terribly obtrusive to my schedule, and um, so I was like, okay, I'm going to take the opportunity to record, and if I sound a little upset, um, I am, I'm a little stressed, but I also very much want to be able to record. I keep forgetting to get rid of these balloons, um, because it's important to me to get all of this done. So Kang is on his way home, Elliot is here, he is, uh, he's asking, uh... Helix for a bedtime story. And yeah, he's gonna do that. Um I was gonna give oh yeah, he I think last time I showed you Elliot's bedroom. He's gonna be sharing once Hedron ages up uh, like Spike. Once Hedron ages up, he's going to um Yeah, he's gonna move in here with, uh, with Elliot. I don't, there's not a ton of room, but I think we can actually fit a bed right here. So that's what we'll do. And they'll just share it. Um, I'm so sorry if I sound really agitated right now. <laughs> Excuse me. It's, I mean, it's fine. Um, it could be a mod. I'm gonna try to take out some of my mods. I've got to mess around with some settings. <sighs> but like I said, it's also really important that I get some content out there. So, like I, I, I know it's annoying. It's really weird to have the game like this. And maybe if I restart it, but I actually restarted it once. And that didn't make a difference. There is a sound glitch that, as of yet, I mean, it's been around for a long time. As of yet, it doesn't actually have a uh, viable fix, which I also find to be kind of irritating. Um, to be completely 100% honest. Um, I don't know if there, <coughs> excuse me, there are just a lot of instances where, I mean, and okay, the natural inclination, oh, he wants to sleep with his mom. All right. The, uh, no. Okay, guys, what's going on here? Hugh, no, you're not doing that. Stop. No. 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 You have computers in here. Don't be rude to your sister. She needs to go to sleep. She has a job. Come on out here. And if you want to work on solving the unsolvable, something like that. I don't know why he's a computer whiz. Did I make him? Oh, with, with uh, that trade. Okay. Pepper's getting taken care of. She's sleeping. Helia is hanging out with Hedron a little bit. That's nice. Um, and Hannah, definitely. I mean, she's not that tired, but she needs some sleep. And Elliot definitely needs some sleep. So let's send Elliot actually out to his bed. Why are you... Okay, I know you're hungry. But you definitely, definitely don't need to be eating... Um, go ahead and have some autumn salad. You don't need to be eating a snow cone. They don't even fill you up. It's really kind of uh, annoying how much the Sims fixate on that. So go ahead and here and sleep. Pepper, you don't... Mm. Oh my god, you guys are being bananas. She's gonna go ahead and sleep. Helix is going down to clean things up. Hedron's doing just fine. 
he's playing with his... Give Sunny a girl's name. Um, we're still gonna go with Sunny. There we go. Um, nope. Nope. Why don't you go and go back in and sleep? I wish there were a way to set a schedule so that when sims are sleeping, TVs or radios in the same room can't be turned on, if that makes any sense. I'd really like that. That would be cool. She wants to improve social networking. We can do that. He's having a nice shower. They really like the shower in here. And Kang is sleeping. Thank you, Kang, for sleeping in the proper bed. I really very much appreciate that. That's pretty cool of you. Um, he's gonna work on reports. Why? Okay, his partner... Work relationships. His partner is... Okay, why is his relationship... His work relationship down with his husband? That doesn't make a lick of sense to me. Elliot, what are you doing? No, stop. Is he... Okay, is this in the way? And, uh, Helia, yeah, you need to, you need to bugger off. You need to bugger off. Come on down here. Why don't you have something to eat? Let's clear up that autumn salad. Okay, so there's a, there's a pathing glitch. Okay, something's in the way. This table, I guess. No, the table should fit just fine. It snaps, too. Um, it might be the globe. Let's see. Let's see. Elliot, get on up here. Yeah, computers too. Be nice. He's heading in. Okay, it looks like we might be... Might be okay. Go ahead and eat, and then... You should work on your social networking skill if it's really that important to you. Let's so go ahead and stream a video and um, let's go to the blog app. And she can blog about something. Oh, Hugh gave up because he's super tired, but you're going to need to eat before you go to bed. Um, eat some key lime pie and then go to sleep. No, no more coffee. No. <laughs> no. Um, let's see. Sleeping. Sleeping. She's actually got work in like a day, but she's got to work on skills, so we're going to send her to the gym. Um, Pepper is sleeping, and she works in 11 hours. Hedron is chilling in his crib. Uh, what are you doing there, Helix? No, you can't play computer. Your wife is sleeping. Why don't you work from home? Go ahead and do that. I like to assume that maybe that he's doing some sort of hacking or research on something nefarious. That'd be nice. Oh, good. He's, he's in his bed. He's got school in five hours, and he's exhausted. And he didn't do his homework. Elliot, you don't want to... Oh, excuse me. You don't want to take over in terms of, like, you know, it take after your... Ah, my headphones got caught. Take after your mother's de like, sheer degree of, um, of dysfunction. Um... Oh, let's see how this does. Probably poorly. Oh, it's great. We got a hundred. Oh, lost 125 followers. Yeah. What the frig? So annoying. Um, go ahead and I want her to clean that up. She's gonna flatter her. Today's spooky day. Okay, the kids don't have school, so we can send them trick or treating. Oh, turn off. 
they still haven't cleaned up these Christmas toys, you know, ever since Elena was alive. What are you doing? Very ignorant. You are a mess. No. Go upstairs and see your husband. Sleep. Helia should throw a spooky day engagement party. Ooh. Let's do that. Um, throw a party. Her bachelorette party. Um, we're gonna actually... No, we're not gonna have a party at 7 a.m. That's weird. We're gonna throw it at 5, dress to impress. We're gonna go ahead and invite Alfonso. She's not above inviting gentlemen's. Not actually sure why she can't invite Sophia. It's so okay, good. I was gonna say it's Sophia's party. Um Yeah, we'll go with that. Five PM. Gonna get a stripper in here. Yeah. Be cool if there were a mod where they could actually um where they could actually like strip. Not not necessarily to any degree of pornographic level, but just for funsies. Take an evil shower. For funsies. Okay, why don't you take um Hedron Hedron's motives like go down really slowly. Uh why don't you take him out and um change his diaper? He looks how you doing. Oh he's gotta go wee wee's. <laughs> Wee wees. After you change his diaper, we can. Oh. Helly is having her steam. We can have her come up and recombobulate that. Um, yeah, after she. Der. After she changes his diaper. We'll potty train. Ah, oh, we'll potty train him, which is counterintuitive, but whatever. Let's go ahead in here and purchase something. Do you have any. Do we have a potty chair? Yeah, no, no. Mep, 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 no. Okay. Sort by function for Babis. And we're gonna get this sexy potty chair. Sexy, I'm so weird. We're gonna get this very attractive potty chair and put it somewhere convenient. Like, I guess that could get in the way of the bed. Let's see. Put it at the end of the bed. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna teach him to make some dukes in the potty chair. Sorry, I'm trying to amuse myself because I'm pretty bummed. It's it sounds dumb probably, but I was like I was hardcore crying um <laughs> earlier. I was like, no, my computer it doesn't work. What are you doing? Be argued with? Uh, what are you arguing with her about? I don't know if you want to take on Helia. I mean, Helix, you're a badass, but you've literally never killed somebody <laughs> Hannah has in fact when she was at college she finished the job when it came to killing um killing Sid Sura she she went for it when she was there she asked him out on a date and uh she took him out and sort of got him relaxed and hung out with him and uh, unfortunately she murdered him well unfortunately for him fortunately for her because the family expected it it was expected of her Kang how you doing you need to take a shower buddy um nope that's broken so go ahead in here and take a shower everything is breaking hell yeah come here and recombobulate this and recombobulate that and then go ahead and take care of your uh your what's it's play video game um your mom's being super annoying play video game play a sports game oh the chairs in my what the you can sit in this chair sit can you get out Okay, no, this room's a little tight. I might have to shove this over a little bit. Pepper's not interested in whatever's going on here. 
Okay, he's going to continue his painting. He's a beautiful artist. No, you don't need to critique that. You don't... No. No. Don't be crappy. Don't be crappy. Um... Why don't you just have some yogurt? Because it's good for your intestines. And she's going to not break a sweat. Ideally. And... Her athletic skill is going to go up faster because she's at the gym. Which is nice. And let's see. Friendly. Ask about day. They'll probably enjoy gossiping. You don't want to be mean. Special. Evil. Mastermind plot. She's having some yogs. Oh, she put like jam on there. There you go. It raises their health or their hunger a little bit, but not that much. Hugh's still resting. Oh, Hugh, I'm, I'm going to miss you when you go. He's 99 days old. I don't think we have much longer with him. It would be really interesting if he were to die today, like on the anniversary of his engagement to, uh, to Evelina. That would actually be kind of, kind of bananas. What are you? Jeez, stop it. Friendly, applaud hard work. Compliment cleverness. Make him feel good about himself because apparently that's what Helix needs. <laughs> what can you teach him? Teach Felipe's Kenspa. And go ahead and teach him some advanced technology. She's drawing a bit. She has a fine arts degree. And she's teaching him a skill. And Elliot is playing with his buddy. And why don't you go ahead and actually play that video game? He's pretty tired. Um, well, you know, I lied. Why don't you go ahead and take a nap? Wow, he looks learned that really fast. How you doing, Kang? No work today. No work. They always want to throw a feast party. He wants to do laundry. Why don't we have him do that? Okay, and their relationship is going up. How you doing, baby boy? You want to keep playing with your toy? He's still earning some lifetime reward points. I think we'll be able to get him there. He's got his advanced tech skill to level 2. This is something I think that Helia would want to pass on to her son. Um, you know, it's really important to her that their family's legacy is intact and invaluable. Um, admire your mom. Funny. Show a funny video. Let's see. I'm so sorry about the... Asked to be a surrogate mother. Oh, yeah, okay. That's a... That's a thing with the hospital mod. That's kind of creepy. Mm, it's kind of creepy. Why don't you go ahead and watch the cooking channel? You're bugging the crap out of me, Pepper, with this critiquing. Oh, view costume party. Uh, Sophia's throwing a party, so she's not going to be here. Um, let's see. And we're going to change to the cooking channel. Is the TV broken? Jesus. Oof. Come here and recombobulate this for your wife, please. And she's heading up. To, uh, go ahead and recombobulate this. And then restore your brain power. Aliens are the best. They're just the bestest. You don't need to prepare pumpkin pie. Eat the lip. No, you don't need to go out there. Thank you. Prepare. Okay, if you want to make ratatouille, go ahead. Are you done working out? She wants to fight with someone. She wants to be a jerk to someone. Chad to listen. Listen to insult. 
Where's this person who's insulting her? Oh, because of that lady she like shook down and killed? Is that it? Is this person gonna appear? Is it him? No, it's him. Oh, Beppe. Mean. Insult. She's not having any of it. Argue. Mean. She's like, you're gonna come up here and be crappy to me. Mean. He's being a diva. She could, uh, she wouldn't have any compunctions about killing him. I mean, we like Beppe, but, uh, complain about good people. I mean, she wants to fight, so we'll get her there. We'll get it there. Are you? Insult. Mean. Your ignorance again. Unforgivably rude. She doesn't even care anymore if she goes to jail. Petty jab. Point out flaws. Clyde Mother's a llama. I actually get the sense that she she probably wants to pull Beppe aside and kill him. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Impolite? What is that? Like, seriously, she's not being impolite. She's being really rude. Declare him a nemesis. And fight. Let's see. There we go. She won. Because, of course, she won. And he's got to pee. Go on upstairs, Ralph. He peed himself. Go on upstairs, Ralph. Mean. She is going to mock him. And, uh... <coughs> excuse me. Oh, we need to wait till somebody is... Like, people aren't coming in the door. Go upstairs. Get out of here. Nobody wants you to talk to us. Go away. Go away. Is he coming to the party later? Um, mean, argue. Let's see if we can call him outside. Be interesting if you could drown him. I'm just in kind of a mood. Let's see. His wee wee's on the floor. Um. You know what? She's just. She's just gonna go for it. Let's see. Relationships. All. Is Beppe one of her good friends? No, I don't think she'll care. I don't think she'll care. She doesn't care if people hate her. I mean, she's going to poison him. And I like Beppe, but that's what's happening. 
Oh, Starry wants to come out. She has a, she has a poison that she can, she can use. And you need to go home. You need to get out of here. Don't mourn. Go. Get out of here before the police come. Poor Beppe. We're gonna have to move his grave. We'll come back here for it later. She's like, no, I'm out of here. She wants to resurrect Beppe. We'll we'll promise it. Maybe she's feeling a little badly for just uh gr this crime of passion. What's happening here? Oh yeah, she just figured out she's pregnant. Is she? Oh, there's the alarm. Cause she is. She's pregnant. Um, go ahead and mop up the puddle. Unless it's not gonna work. That would suck. Oh, there it is. Now Shannon has to be like, yep, I'm pregnant. Hannah, are you home? She's like, mm, I'm good. He died of hunger. She gave him a poison, which uh, made him hungry. Made it, it basically made his stomach completely liquefy. It was a powerful poison. Poisons don't actually really work that way. Hey everyone, and welcome to my new sort of in-stream sweepstakes things thingies. I figured the best place to start was going to be with Monte Vista. Now, I'm going to try to do one of these across all of my series um, before too long. But the first one is coming here in Monte Vista because Monte Vista was my first series, and there have been some of you who have stuck so long with this series that it's just insane. It's We've been with the Spiegels for a year, and I honestly can't thank you enough for just being here and watching and helping me grow. So, the first thing I'm going to be giving away is the new Sims 3 store set, the Bohemian Gardens. Um, it's really cool. I did a review of it and I'm going to link that in the, uh, like at the end of the video and I'll try to remember to link it in the description. So, what I need you to do is, you know, the the rundown that how people usually do it. I'm not going to use Rafflecopter or anything this time, but what I need you to do is just go ahead and leave me a comment and your Sims 3 name in the, uh, the comment section. And I'm going to choose using a random number generator. And, um, yeah, I'm excited to give it a shot. Now, if there's an issue with me contacting you or something, my Sims 3 name is linked on my main channel up in the, the banner area. You can, it's linked there and it's also linked, um, yeah, in the description as well. So if you have to friend me or something and then let me know, we can do that. So, okay, I'm done. I'm shutting up. And yeah, so go ahead, leave your Sims 3 name and your, uh, well, just comment in the section. You don't have to like, you don't have to subscribe or anything like that. Um, you know, you just have to, you just have to be here watching. So thank you very, 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 very much. And we're going to get back to the video. Bye. Answering the phone. She's making some mac and cheese. I have the assassination mod, but because she wasn't on the lot, I don't think she can take credit for it. Or actually, maybe it raised the skill. Oh yeah, it raised the skill, just because. Listen, what's he gonna say? And let's bring out his imaginary friend. I don't think we're gonna have the imaginary friend actually come to life. That's something I want to do for Hedron. Oh, look at you. Look at you. What's Helia gonna wear? Okay. Continue cooking. Oh my god, what are you doing? This is gonna set fire. Okay, we're gonna have a fire. Come on. Cook, 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 cook. It's gonna catch fire. Oh my god, thank you. Cook. Oh yeah, there it is. 
Extinguish. Come on. Oh, Shannon. Oh, Shannon. I'm going to have to change her clothes. And here we go. We've been called away from the fire. <laughs> and Starry's like, oh, crap. Oh, shnikes. What went on here? Okay. We're just going to go ahead and replace. What did. It's because she was getting dressed again. Who's this? Pepper's looking fine. Oh, there she is. Um, so go ahead, romantic. Give her flowers to celebrate this wonderful day. Oh, and everybody's dancing. And this is broken. And Helix is gonna start a bonfire so that everybody can have some fun. Oh, Helix, what are you wearing? Oh, what are you wearing? And we're gonna go ahead and add some basil seed and see how that goes. Oh, there's Moochin. You call that a party? Whatever, I'm leaving. Pepe, don't be crappy. She's gotta go to the bathroom. Um, can she get there? Don't pee yourself. Don't do it. Kang has increased his charisma. Okay, so we're done. This is the end of the episode. <sighs> Thank you for your patience. I'm so sorry about the sound. Um, I was gonna record another part after this, but I gotta reload my game and see if it's fixed. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you again. Please remember to give this video a rating and drop me a comment, tell me what you think. Um, and, uh, yeah, what are we gonna do? Should, should Helia get married at the same park where her father got married? Because she did blow it up. I don't know if she actually wants to get married there. Or should we have her get, excuse me, get married somewhere else? Um, what else? Oh, yeah. In case you're not aware, I started doing a novelization of my Runaway Teen series. It is available on my website, which is www.symbiotegames.com. It's spelled the S-I-M-B-I-O-T-E. And uh, it's called Brush Burns, just like the first episode. It's there. It's available. And I'm going to change Shannon's clothes because they're making me nuts. All right, so... That's the end of the episode. Thank you so much, and I will see you next time. Bye!